potential energy. The symbol we used for potential energy last year was what, Vlad? Uh, potential energy. Gravitational potential energy, elastic potential energy, electric potential energy. PE with a subscript of whatever it was. I will continue to use that sometimes. I will probably more often use the uh, convention that is in this book, which is a U, which is the energy, the potential energy. I think it's a U, because you could put stuff in it, like it would hold something. I don't really know why they use a U, but that's how I picture it. So U for, it has potential, it can hold stuff, and you can put soup in it. <laughs> so, we have, for example, gravitational potential energy. Remind me, what is the equation for gravitational potential energy? Emily? MGH. <coughs> Where M is the mass, G is 9.8 <coughs> meters per second squared. What is H? Nick? Remember, H is the height above what is called the zero line. The zero line is something that you need to set anytime you're talking about gravitational potential energy. Uh, it doesn't really matter so much where it is. Uh, it can make your job a little bit easier depending on where you set it, but really you just need to figure out where to put the zero line. We also have the energy stored in a spring. So that is the potential energy stored in a spring, which is we actually went through this last time. What's the potential energy stored in a spring, Tim? It is not, that would be the force actually associated with a spring. That's not the energy. Emily? One half kx. One half kx squared. Remind me, what is k, Bill? Spring constant. The spring constant. What are the dimensions generally on the spring constant? Time? Newtons per meter. Newtons per meter. What is x in one half kx squared, Henry? The equilibrium position, the equilibrium position, we also have another term sometimes we use for that. It is, Andrew, what? I don't remember. Oh. I, uh, we'll see if it spreads. Stasel? Uh oh. Bow hit? The rest position, also called the rest position. So I'll probably use both terms interchangeably. 